Over the weekend, Ukrainian troops were on the retreat as Russian forces have the momentum. The U.S. is rushing aid to Ukraine since the foreign aid package passed last week. But Zelensky says the weapons coming from the U.S. need to come faster because Russia is capitalizing on the holding period, saying Russia's artillery shells outnumber Ukraine's 10 to 1. Ukraine's shortfalls on the battlefield range from manpower to artillery. And Russia is taking advantage, advancing through at least half a dozen villages since February, following a major capture in the critical town of Advika, once held by Ukraine. It's Putin on the offensive. Ukraine pulling back its line of defense as Ukrainian troops over the weekend were ordered to retreat and lose two villages. A top commander saying his troops were outgunned in a dire situation that is worsening as Russia presses against a country waiting on U.S. stockpiles to help them reload on the battlefield. The retreat ordered by Ukraine to strategically and safely position its forces until they can get the new artillery and potentially try to go back into captured areas. Things are not great for Ukraine and are expected to worsen. According to Ukraine's own intelligence, the war will be its most difficult in the coming weeks from mid-May to early June. Zelensky is hopeful the aid from the U.S. can change the situation on the battlefield. While the aid did pass Congress and is on its way this week, there's been skepticism surrounding whether the $60 billion for Ukraine will do anything significant. Some military experts are doubtful it will equip Ukraine for a major offensive operation this year. And the only U.S. lawmaker who is from Ukraine was one who was against the aid package, even for her homeland. You know, we have the false choice of either saying that Ukraine doesn't matter to America or support Ukraine with no question asked, with blank checks. And both these positions are not good in our national interest, and both of these positions are not good in the interest of the people of Ukraine. Now in its third year, people have different viewpoints on how the war is going. Some military experts say this latest round of aid will give Ukraine the chance to prevail, while others believe it will help Ukraine stay in the war, not win it.